on Wednesday I received my new Skywatcher as EQ. Set it up in equatorial mode and then took a short video showing its operation. At this time I'm going to show the mount in its alt as mode. Uh, the mount is set up. I did a fake alignment, two star. And when you do a two star alignment, it gives you a list of the first star. I picked uh, a star. Then it makes you manually center that star. Once the star is manually centered and you align on it, it then goes and gives you a list for the second star. Once you pick a second star, it automatically goes to where it thinks the second star is. You center the second star, and once you've done that, the mount is aligned. Uh, currently, the mount is aiming at the Andromeda Galaxy. To uh, set it up in Altaz mode, you pull out the clamp, turn the handle after loosening the knobs on the side, each side, and when it gets nearly vertical, you remove this knob which comes installed here, this one initially comes here and you switch their positions. This knob has a pin that when you screw it in locks the mount from moving in, a, in, in azimuth, I mean in altitude. And you use an Allen set to tighten it, and you and you store the second one here. So right now I have the mount set up. I'm using the SkyFi unit from Southern uh, Stars to control the mount. I bought the interface cable. I'm plugged into a battery. That's why the green light is on. It's on an external battery, and the unit plugs into the base of the keypad. Now if you can see that, probably not. And right now what I'm doing, I'm using the iPad over here to control the mount. So right now it is centered on the Andromeda Galaxy. I'll search for the target. Search planet, Jupiter, center, go to, now the mount is moving to where it thinks Jupiter is, coming back to Sky-Fi, I mean, in the iPad, Sky Safari, Jupiter is now centered in the field of view. You can zoom out, scroll around. Let's see if I can find uh, the sculpted galaxy. Sculpt the galaxy. Go to. And you can see as the mount approaches. It beeped when it's on the object, and now it's tracking on the Sculptor Galaxy. So far, I've only been able to test the mount inside, but uh, so I like what I see. Uh, hopefully this weekend I'll be able to get the mount outside and uh, give it a test under the real stars.